Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x minus 4 bracket power of 3 is equal to negative 8. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, in the first step, we'll take this negative 8 into the left side. So, it will be this, which is x minus 4, then bracket power of 3. Negative 8 to take to this side, it will be plus 8 is equal to 0. Then it will be x minus 4 bracket power of 3 plus 8 is same as 2 power of 3 is equal to 0. Then from this side, which is x minus 4 bracket power of 3 plus 2 power of 3, they have same power of 3 but different bases. Here we have addition. Now this part is in the form of algebraic rule. We'll apply algebraic, in this, algebraic rule in this form. Whereas this is in the form of a power of 3 plus b power of 3, which is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a square minus ab plus b square bracket. So when we compare a power of 3 with x minus 4 bracket power of 3, then a is equal to x minus 4. And when you compare b power 3 with 2 power 3, then b is equal to 2. Then we will apply this form. So it will be a plus b, it is x minus 4 plus 2. So in here, it will be x minus 4 plus 2 bracket bracket a square. It will be this square. So x minus 4 bracket square. Then minus a b. Here it will be minus a x minus 4 times b is 2. So it will be 2 bracket x minus 4 bracket. Then plus this b square. It will be this which is 2 square. Then bracket is equal to this which is 0. Then in the next step it will be x minus 4 plus 2 is same as 2 minus 4 which is minus 2 bracket bracket the square of x minus 4 it will be x times x which is x square then minus 2 times 4 is 8 8 times x is 8 x then plus 4 times 4 it is 16 then we open this bracket by this negative 2 so to be negative 2 times x is negative 2 x negative 2 times negative 4 it is positive 8 then plus 2 square is 4 bracket is equal to 0 then in the next step it will be x minus 2 bracket bracket with x square we have this x square then with x we have negative 8x with negative 2x it is negative 10x then with constant we have 16 plus 4 is 20. 20 plus 8 is 28. So here it will be plus 28 bracket is equal to this 0. Then in the next step, in here we have two solutions. Whereas this is the first solution. So it will be x minus 2 is equal to this 0. And the second solution, it is this x square minus 10x plus 28 is equal to 0. Then to solve from this first solution, we'll take negative 2 to this side. So it will be x is equal to 2. So this is the first value of x, which is the real solution. Now to solve from this quadratic equation, we'll solve by using quadratic formula to find the values of x. So from quadratic formula, it will be x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a then it will be x is equal to negative b it is this negative 10 bracket plus or minus square root of b square it will be this which is negative 10 bracket square then minus 4 times a a is 1 times c c is this 28 then over 2 times a a is 1 
then in the next step it will be x is equal to negative and negative to be positive 10 then plus or minus square root of negative 10 square it is 100 negative 4 times 1 times 28 it will be negative 4 times 8 is 32 go with 3 4 times 2 is 8 8 plus 3 it is 11 then over this time this is 2 then in the next step it will be x is equal to 10 plus or minus square root of 100 minus 112 it is negative 12 then over this 2 then from here it will be x is equal to 10 plus or minus square root of negative 12 is same as 4 times 3 times negative 1 then over this 2 then it will be x is equal to 10 plus or minus square root of 4 is 2 square root of negative 1 is i then times this square root of 3 then we divide by 2 in this part and in this part then in the next step it will be x is equal to 10 divided by 2 it is 5 plus or minus 2i divided by 2 it is i then times this square root of 3 so in here this is the complex solution whereas in here we have two solutions because of plus or minus so the first value of x is equal to into this first solution it is equal to 2 and the second value of x is equal to from here into the complex solution it will be 5 plus i square root of 3 so here 5 plus i square root of 3 and the third value of x is equal to when it is negative it will be 5 minus i square root of 3 so here 5 minus i square root of 3 so these are all the values of x in this our problem whereas we have one real solution and two complex solutions now to check if these solutions are correct we'll check for this only this real solution if it will satisfy in our equation now let's check for this x is equal to 2 so back into our problem we'll check for x is equal to 2 so we we'll substitute 2 into here so it will be 2 minus 4 bracket power of 3 here into x it will be 2 minus 4 bracket power of 3 is it equal to this which is negative 8 then in here 2 minus 4 it is negative 2 bracket power of 3 is it equal to negative 8 then negative 2 power of 3 is same as negative 2 times negative 2 times negative 2 now negative 2 times negative 2 ne tem negative 2 times negative 2 is positive 4 4 times negative 2 it is negative 8 which is equal to this negative 8 now left side and right side are equal then it is true for the value of x is equal to 2 and also the other complex solution are correct thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye